watching, you've heard me talk about my new favorite game, Solitaire Grand Harvest. Well, you can try it too. You just download the free game by scanning the QR code on your screen. I love playing this game because it keeps your brain sharp with tons of cool mini challenges and challenges and games. It's nostalgic because it brings back the fun of the 90s solitaire, but in an exciting and modern way. So speaking of nostalgia, we're catching up with a special guest today. In the 80s and 90s, you'd see her every week hosting the iconic Showtime at the Apollo. And I am so excited to catch up with her. Please welcome Kiki Shepard! <laughs> Love is so wonderful. Hey, Sherry. Girl, let me tell you something, cousin, because we both got Shepherd. Yeah. Like, I, I cannot believe how amazing you look at 71 years old. That's right. That's right, mama. <laughs> Ain't God good? He is so good. 24-7. 24. And you said that your like your your mother looks at half your age. Was it your mother or your My grandma? mom. My your mom. mom, yes. Our mom. Mom is gone now. She's in heaven now. But when mom passed at 80, she looked like she was 50 years old. Wow. Jeans, baby. You jeans. got the good jeans. Good jeans. <laughs> you know, I just want to say, we, you know, I, like I said to John, that was my, my watching that I used to do, watching Showtime at the mm -hmm. Apollo. And you hosted it. You used to host. Everybody remembers you, Kiki. Yeah. But you hosted with the most amazing comedians, Sinbad, Mark Curry, Rudy Rush, Steve Harvey. Yes. Now, out of all of those, did you have a favorite? You know, each one of them brought something absolutely special. You know, Mark and, and, and Rudy, they had their great comedic talent. Sinbad established us as co-hosts. Oh. So I have a great love in my heart for Sinbad. But Steve brought us the, 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 the length of time that we needed to create a masterpiece at the amazing Apollo Theater. So I have a love for each one of them in a different way. There you go. Now, when you were a, when you were a, a host, you saw you saw so many acts at, when you were a host. Ooh. Did you ever when did you ever see a performance, Kiki, and you said they're gonna be big? Yes. Who's I have two that always come to mind. First of all, Life Jennings, okay. who came straight out of prison onto the show wow. and ended up winning the whole amateur night season for that season. But then the one that really sticks in my mind is the beautiful 13-year-old Lauren Hill. Ooh! Wow! That baby came on the show. We knew she was going to be a star, and look at her now. And look at her now. Look at her now. Now, along with the ones that are really good, you know, they rubbed the whole the, the tree <laughs> for luck. But the ones who were really good, there were some crazy ones Ooh. there that I remember seeing. Do you remember any any crazy ones? Yeah, the crazy woman that turned around and mooned the audience. Oh, what happened? <laughs> what did she do? Okay, she had on this black cat suit. I know it had to be fixed up so you didn't see it because they would not have let her on the stage. Right. But Sin, uh, not Sinbad, um, Sandman was getting ready to come get her and swoosh off. She got mad and turned to the audience and dropped her flap and <laughs> moved. The entire audience, they loved it though. <laughs> <laughs> we all loved it, it was great. <laughs> but that Sandman came and got her off. Sandman swooshed on off anyway. <laughs> Go on, girl. Oh, girl. Go on, girl. You know, people may not know this, Kiki, but you were a professional dancer for yeah. so many years. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, you were. Yeah. You even performed with Aretha Franklin. Yes, I performed yes. with so many people, Sherry. You know, I was on Broadway for 10 straight years, okay. auditioned once and went for 10 straight years. Yes. On many shows, I had Aretha Franklin, Lionel Richie, Donna Ross, and Michael Jackson with The Wiz, wow. Gregory Hines. I mean, yeah, it was a wonderful era. That's you with Aretha Franklin right there. Boy. Look at that. Look at how little was I. Oh, my oh, word. You, girl, you was tiny. I and was still look the same. Doggone. Thank you, Sherry. Girl. That's so sweet of you. <laughs> You know, and, and I love it because this is when I met you in L.A. Uh, yeah. uh, with your organization, your foundation, mm -hmm. because now your life's mission is to spread awareness about sickle cell disease. Yes, it is. Can you tell us about your foundation? Uh, I, founded, I founded the KIS Foundation uh, about 16 years ago, and we are dedicated to improving the 
social quality of life for adults, families, children suffering and living with sickle cell disease because we believe about, we want to improve the social health and quality of life for those that are diagnosed. Because you know, sickness has no boundaries, but yeah. compassion has no limits. There That's you what go. we yeah. That is it. You know, and I know you're always busy because I get the emails from you and you're always having events to, you know, raise money for your foundation kids for Sickle Cell. And it, it keeps you so busy. Yeah. Is there anything you like to do to unwind, Kiki? Let's see, what do I like to do? I like to dance and have fun, do cuffing and stuff with my girls, my two <laughs> girls that I raised. Yeah. Yes. And of course, I continue to host and just enjoy life with my friends. And let me just give a shout out right now because a lot of people don't know it, but Sherry has been a major supporter of the KIS Foundation for years. Girl. For years. She, she and John Murray came to our bowling tournament. Yes. Now we don't do bowling, we do golf now. But Sherry has hosted our comedy shows. All of this to raise awareness and yes. funding to support our crisis care package. Because we love you and love what you do. And I love you. We love you. Our board of directors said to tell you thank you, Sherry, oh, so course. much. Oh, of course. My pleasure. Act well, by now, you know I love to unwind by playing Solitaire Grand Harvest. Oh. And if you scan the QR code or you visit the App Store or Google Play to download the free mobile game right now, I promise it's a good time. I want to say thank you to my love, Kiki Shepard, yeah. for being here. Yeah. We'll be right back. Kiki Shepard! Yeah.